Another successful Hickory night for the Pacers, and what a night it's been. You know, there's no Hickory if there's no movie Hoosiers, and certainly there's no movie Hoosiers if there's no Milan High School and no last shot by the great Bobby Plum. What's this like being here? Hey, isn't this, this is just wonderful, Eddie. It's absolutely marvelous. Whoever thought of this idea, congratulations. I love it. What do you think when the Pacers said, we're going to do this program, the Hickory program, we're going to honor all of basketball in the state of Indiana. This started with your shot. Yeah, it, it, that's what's amazing about this whole thing. But I would, I would say not just the shot, but the movie Hoosiers had something to do with this. And it's wonderful to see all these people come out. We've had a great time this evening. And all I can say is, Eddie, it's nice to be remembered. Oh, you'll never be forgotten. I know that. <laughs> I talked to Angelo Pizzo and David Anspa. They can't believe it's been 30 years since Hoosiers. It was a few years older than that that you made your shot and you had that miracle run. Does it seem like yesterday or does it seem like a long time ago? No, it doesn't seem like a long time ago because I get a chance to talk about it almost every week, you know. Something's coming up or people come to our restaurant, Plump's Last Shot, they, uh, and they come from all over the United States. And they have these question. I told uh, CBS Today on television two weeks ago, I got a letter from a gentleman wanted an autograph. He lives in France. And that's not near Mishawaka or Goshen. That's the France across the pond. It sure ain't close to Milan either. <laughs> <laughs> now, if it talks about your last shot, you probably had some great golf shots too. Pardon me? You probably had some great golf shots too in your life. Well, it's been wonderful. You know, I, I had been, uh, I had some great golf shots, but I can tell you this, I'm glad there wasn't any television out there on my golf shots because I, call, I talk a better game than I hit. Well, I'll tell you what, you have just been a joy for us to work with over all these years. You're the, you're the perfect example of what Hoosier basketball is all about, and you know this organization, the Pacers, the Fever Bankers Life, they love you. I'm going to tell you what, I love them too, and all the fans and everybody that supported us all the way through. It's just a great, great experience, and it's wonderful to be alive. I love you, brother. I love you too, Eddie. You take care. God bless you.